What's up guys, Danny Lee here, Director of Personal Training for Gold's Gym. We're getting ready to explain to you guys an amazing fat blasting hit program, all right? So what we're gonna be using today is we're gonna be using the, um, the Matrix Treadmill. All right, we call it Dead Mill because you gotta move the power and the uh, tread itself. And then a kettlebell, all right? Plus body weight and stuff. All right, so if you look at the program here, Basically, we're doing five rounds. Okay, I have this written out for you guys just so you can get a good close-up look at it in case you need to write these exercises down. All right, so the first sequence we're gonna do, this whole routine should be about 45 to 50 minutes long. All right, so the first sequence we're gonna do is a 30-second sprint and 30 seconds of kettlebell swings. So we're gonna come on here, set this belt up, make sure it's about mid midsection high. Making sure about my sprint tension here, you know, this, uh, this tension down on the left. All right, so I'm gonna do my watch. I would hit hard, 30 second sprint. You would hit hard. Once I'm done with that, you're right off, right to the kettlebell. Again, I'm doing 30 seconds of kettlebell swings. Nice and simple. Then you got a break, all right? And I want you to rest anywhere from 15 to 30 seconds between two exercises, all right? Your next sequence, we have five sequence total. It's gonna to be a back pedal, 30 seconds, with a burpee upright, all right? So I'm gonna have the belt above my butt here. I'm gonna go to a back pedal. Driving off the balls of my feet. 30 seconds, same deal. Kettlebell I'm gonna have over. Now I'm gonna put my body above the kettlebell, so you might take this all the way down. So my hands are here. Jump my feet nice and wide. Then I'm bringing it up to the chin. Same deal, nice and wide. Up to the chin. All right, so we're gonna move to sequence three. Sequence three is we're gonna go to a side shuffle, 30 seconds each side. So that's gonna be a 60 second interval. Moving right into squat jumps. All right, so I'm gonna keep the belt about my oblique area, above my hip, and then I'm gonna skip. Staying on the balls of my feet. One side, you're gonna drive, once it's 30 seconds. Right to the other. All right, side is gonna be with squat jumps. Then I'm just stepping off, just using my body weight. Up and down, 30 seconds. All right, make sure you guys are sitting down in those squat jumps. Now these little half squats, I see some of you guys doing. <clears throat> All right, so now we're moving to our fourth sequence here. Almost done. Here, you're gonna lean in, take the belt on top, a little bit behind you. This time, right tension down, left tension up for the sled drive. We're gonna hold at the lower bars. Again, get your clock set, 30 seconds. Hit hard. All right, hit the high intensity interval training. You wanna go highest intensity as you possibly can with that 30 seconds. All right, so sled drive, super set with the power pushbacks. So I'll just take this wall, feet against the wall, Hands tight to the, like, my armpits. Pushing myself back. All right. My knees are off the ground when I'm all the way back. Last but not least, I'm gonna go to a back pedal and then to a full sprint. Need both these intervals of 30 seconds. I call this turn and burn. So we're gonna connect the belt again. That tension back down. Sprint tension up. Okay, now we're going to a back pedal. 30 seconds. Then we're going right into a sprint. 30 seconds, as fast as you can. Now from there, we're going to a tricep extension. We're going to get the kettlebell. We're just up and down. Again, that's going to be 60 seconds on its own. So that last one is a minute and a minute. All right, so you want to, after that, all five sequences are done, then you repeat. We're gonna repeat that five rounds as fast as possible. All right, it's gonna be a tough exercise <clears throat> workout, but it's amazing, guys. There's nothing like it. All right, stay tuned for the next one. See you soon.